Hey, what's going on YouTube? This is Dottie with Ignite Cinemas, and today I have a quick tutorial on how to duplicate a project using Final Cut Pro 10. Let's get it. Excuse the clutter, usually my screen does not look like this. In fact, I'm getting a little anxiety, but that's what happens when you're cranking out projects, son. But today I'm gonna be doing a very, very easy tutorial. In fact, I feel like this is so easy yet a lot of people don't capitalize on being able to do this and that's duplicating your project in Final Cut Pro 10. Now, this becomes extremely useful, especially in my world when I'm editing projects for my clients and sometimes I want, might wanna make an alteration, but always have that peace of mind that I could go back and have the original. And this works great whether you're doing testimonial videos wedding videos, event recaps, or any project. You know, I do them all the time. And if you look right here, even for some of my vlogs, I might be duplicating the project. And it's super easy to do. So first of all, you're gonna wanna come over here to your left and you see I have a lot of projects. Let's say in this testimonial video, you know, I liked everything that's going on, but let's say, you know, I like certain overlays or I might, like a, another color grade better than this one. So the easy way to do this is to duplicate it. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna come over to projects and we're gonna right click and you're gonna see duplicate project or duplicate project as a snapshot. Now I always do duplicate project. From what I've heard, duplicate projects as snapshots or more in tune with compound clips and things of that nature, which I don't have no compound clips in what I'm using and I've always 100% used duplicate project. Please excuse my phone right there. So I'm gonna duplicate the project. And then once you do that, you see it automatically adds a one to it. So this indicates that this is a new draft. So here is my original. And let's say, you know, I wanted to change this scene and move it over here and maybe play around with the color grade for this scene right here. And let's change this and pretty much I want you guys to show you that you guys can have a peace of mind when you're editing your projects that way if you feel this one was better and you send it off and maybe a client wasn't feeling it so much you could always go back to the safeguard zone and have what you originally created this is super very easy to use and very 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 helpful in your processes when you're editing and especially if you have ideas and you want to do this you want to do that but you want to have a fallback plan because fallback plans are awesome please utilize the duplicate project feature on final cut pro 10 hopefully this tutorial was super easy to follow and you guys could benefit if you guys did please smash that like button and if you want to see more tutorials using final cut pro 10 as well as some gear unboxings reviews and filmmaking tips and tricks Please don't hesitate, hit that red button, subscribe to the channel so you never miss a video, and as always, don't forget to ignite. See ya!